Hello, my name is Chris Warren, and I'm one of the senior sales engineers here at Datto, and today we're going to be going over Diskless Restore. Um, I am interfacing with a physical data device here on-prem through its local IP address up here in my address bar, and then within that data device, I'm under the Restore tab with three simple columns. First column, choose a system, all the different servers and workstations that I'm backing up to that data device. Second column, different types of restoration acts I can do for that particular environment that I'm backing up. And then in this scenario, I'm going to choose Diskless Restore. And now the third column is going to populate the different types of restores I can do within the Diskless Restore. So just to explain what Diskless Restore means, really what it is, it's, it's two parts. It's like a hybrid type of solution, uh, killing two birds with one stone type scenario. And let me explain to you what that means. So the first part of the solution is um, where you are going to be able to perform a virtualization of sorts from a particular recovery point. And let me explain to you how that works. You're going to go through the same steps as a bare metal restore. You're taking a gig stick, one of those little flash drive, thumb drive things, sticking it in the front of the data device. The data will download uh, any particular bootable content needed from a specific recovery point. So it becomes like a key now. Now you take that newly created gig stick and you go down the hall to whatever machine you're looking to um, pull some resources or possibly even re-image to boot up from that newly created gig stick and what it'll do is it'll start to communicate back over your network to the data device where you had originally created this gig stick. Now what's going to happen this time though is the data device in turn is going to create an iSCSI connection to that secondary piece of hardware that you had booted up from and stream over via KVM, that stands for kernel virtual machine, what Linux uses to create a virtual environment that particular recovery point. So the DAO device now is treated more like a SAN, more like a storage unit, and you're going to actually leverage the resources from that secondary piece of hardware to power it. So really what this comes down to in the first case scenario is another method of pulling resources from a different facet. Now, the second part of this uh, feature is that while you're doing the streaming of sorts, you're going to be able to re-image simultaneously to that same secondary piece of hardware, a la Bare Metal Restore, same concept. So really what this feature comes down to is this another way you know, that we're trying to close the gap on business continuity and really minimize downtime. It's a really nifty little feature. For more information on how to run anywhere, restore anytime, or protect anything, go to datto.com.